you guys so yeah pretty much in this video just uh yeah i keep getting people telling me all the time that the french's ears first time breeders are going back down again so let me tell you guys right now right now look at boogie as you guys see earlier like they, literally yesterday his ears are all up and then now it's it, it's it's down now one of them's down so what I can say is you do not have to worry. It's it's normal. It happens in French Bulldogs. And it go all, like sometimes it goes up in some like in one day. And then sometimes probably the next day or two days or three days or four days, it's going to go back down. Or one of the ears is going to go back down. Both of them can go back down. So it happens. It happens. It's totally normal. It's totally okay. You know, it's just part of the, the breeding game of French Bulldogs. So it happens. So... I can even show you with another boy that his ear also went back down too, and it's it, it just happens. You know, nothing's you're not you're not doing anything wrong. It's not like they don't have enough calcium. Is the food messed up? No, it's uh, just keep doing what you're doing, and you know, as long as you're growing, that's all that matters. Uh, check for stools and check for the feces. See if everything's all good. And make sure there's no diarrhea. Make sure they're hydrated, and then that's pretty much all you can do. And you know, when when it comes with taping the ears, I can say you guys. Don't worry. Don't you know you don't have to worry about that until they're like literally. Uh, if it goes past by like eight to nine weeks, then yeah, you might possibly have to start worrying about it. But I guess before that, at six seven weeks, um, this this is when their ears are starting to actually really go up. So guys, you know don't don't be worried. You know don't be afraid. You know this is just part of the game. See, look, he's totally fine. He is totally fine and. Cardi's ears, as you guys can see, she her ears just finally came up, and you know maybe next day tomorrow, it it can probably go like one ear can probably go back down. So you just never know, man. These ears are really unpredictable. These bat ears are really unpredictable when it comes to doing stuff like this. You know, it's just it's just part of how puppies are, and you know it's it's pretty fascinating, man. How these bat ears are literally like pugs, first couple weeks of life, and then boom. French Bulldog badasses now. So, yeah, guys. So, for the people that have been messaging me about puppy ears, um, you know, they're getting scared about it. Don't worry about it. It's it's no problem. You know, it's totally okay. It's it's normal. <laughs> it is totally normal. You know, it's okay. It's fine. So, that's pretty much all I, I can say because I've had some numerous litters where this happens all the time. I, I've only had in, in the first three years or well, yeah specifically like three years of actual really breeding um only two puppies out of like so many litters that's actually been late bloomers up until they're like eight to nine weeks so it's it, it happens it, it really happens so uh my uh, my tip again so if, if it goes on farther than two months then yeah you might possibly have to start um taping them and so it's yeah it's totally okay totally fine so uh might need to do calcium tablets if that's the case uh especially if the ears uh, might curl up because uh sometimes the ears can curl up too as well so all right guys thank you guys so much for watching and yeah just chilling and uh updating my videos so yeah uh love you guys so much and yeah like subscribe peace out y'all cardi